That's a Chongus, dude. See one? Yeah, it's it's by me. Oh, oh that let's was so go, sick, dude. dude! Come on, Grandma. V6. Oh, dang, buddy. All right, all right. All right, Chow Chow. No need to go 60 on the ice. No, Not there's cool, a need. Not cool. Smallies are waiting, bud. What is up everyone? Welcome back to the channel and another ice fishing video. If you guys have not subscribed to the channel yet, make sure you guys go down below this video and click on that subscribe button. This afternoon, well it's not even afternoon, it's like midday right now, but we are going to be doing a little bit of sight fishing for some smallmouth bass. So this is what we got going on. Me and John here, aka as you guys refer to him as sweatpants. Anyways, we just got done setting up and I got a huge massive sight hole here So I don't even know how many holes this took to drill But we were drilling for like probably 20 minutes to get this sucker through ice is pretty thick here as you can see So as you can kind of see down there, we got some rocky bottom and it meets into the sandy bottom So pretty much like 20 feet this way outside of the shack There is a rock pile that gets to like 10 feet and it is just straight rocks And then we are in about 12 feet here and it's where it turns from like rocks to more sand so we're right on the edge of a big rock pile and we're gonna be targeting some smallmouth through the ice hopefully we're gonna be running rattle baits and sight fishing these smallmouth so that is enough talking we're gonna drop down there and see if we can start catching some fish here all right so start so starting out today I am going to be running a little frostbite tantrum here or as I like to call it to John a tantrum so I'm gonna send that guy down there and uh, let's start fishing I'm gonna try to get like one out of the ice maybe or something like that and then after that maybe I'll try to put the GoPro down there or get some other cool clips for you guys. But let's start out by catching that first fish. That's a chungus dude. See one? Yeah, it's it's by me. Should I find it? It's not really interested. Luke has one on him right now. Oh yeah, I see him on the end of our camera. This is sick, dude. Yep. Oh. It's right by you. Oh, oh, dude, it's by night. Oh, oh, oh. That let's was so go, sick, dude. dude. That was so sick. He barely has it, Luke. Yeah. Like, he like barely yeah. has it, bro. Oh god, it was tangling with the transducer now. Oh. Yes. Dude, he barely has it. This, that super was soft so bite. Cool. Super that soft was bite. So dope, bro. Super soft bite. Oh my god, dude. Oh, let's go. Nice, dude. Did you see that on the camera? Yeah, bro? that was dope. You I, guys saw that. I could too. see it like under there a little bit really? too, like right away. And then once it got super close, yeah. I watched your camera. So this spot, he came to Luke first, and he wasn't interested. So I started counting about a little bit. He didn't really seem super interested then. But then when I brought it up and I just started giving it little twitches. So the back of the tantrum was just tail button up like that. He loved that. Hello, BW Films fans. My first small of the day. The underwater camera footy was gnarly. Can I buy it for $10.99? Going back down. Come on, buddy. You're good. Come on, buddy. Yep, there he goes. Yeah, let's go, baby. Is he by you? Oh yeah, it is. Oh, it's super skittish. Oh, he did. Yeah. Oh, it's coming back. It's right on me, dude. Coming to you. Oh God. Is it on you? Oh, 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 oh. oh. Come back, come back. 
Come back to me. Come back to me. How did he not eat that? Is it dipping or where is it? Oh, it just dipped off again. He's coming, he's coming to you. He's coming. No, he's coming to you. He's coming to you. <laughs> he's got to hit one of us, right? Oh, there he is. There he is. Dude, that thing's big. All right, well, as you guys saw, we just had a uh, pike swim through by us. We were on our... I'm pretty sure both of us were just on our phones chilling. It's been really slow. There has been, like... We haven't seen any other smallies, um, literally nothing else. I had like a tiny perch swim through my hole and that was it other than that northern. So it's about one o'clock. We're only going to stay here till about three, I think. So I'm going to run back and I'm going to grab a tip up from my trailer and uh, some shiners, maybe some minnows. And I'm going to try to throw a tip up out just to uh, get some different content here and hopefully catch another fish or we can catch that big northern on the tip up. I don't really know, but I'm going to throw a minnow on a tip up, I think, and let's see if we can catch some more fish. Kind of a beast, dude. I don't think anyone that just saw that thinks you're a beast. All right, you guys. Well, as you can see, we are no longer on the lake right now. That is because I was kind of a dummy and I did not do a good job of explaining what was going on once we got done smallie fishing. So pretty much what happened, we caught that one nice smallie. We had the northern come through, look at us. Unfortunately, that did not hit. Then I threw another tip up out and we were trying to catch some northern and some other fish for you guys. But unfortunately, nothing else that we saw bit us or gave us a chance to catch it. So that did not work out for us as well as we expected. So John actually had a buddy, which also was named John, that lived on the same lake that we were sight fishing on. And he invited us out to come out in the snow bear with him and do a little bit of crappie fishing. So we went out there with him and you guys are gonna see those clips right now. And then after that, we are gonna go and actually camp in the trailer and do some more ice fishing in the trailer to wrap this video up. So that is what's going on. That's why we're about to be in a snow bear. And I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Let's go. What, did you say gritty? Did you say gritty? Only in the summertime. <laughs> right on! All right, well, as you can see, we are uh, out in the snow bear. We met up with John with Stickin' Fat... Oh, wait. <laughs> That's my other channel. <laughs> with John from Girthy Girls Guide Service. This evening, instead of trying to catch perch and walleye and chase different fish, we came right back out to where we were catching the crappies in the same area, and we're going to stick to chasing these crappies tonight. So last night, as you saw, if you've seen the last video, we did pretty good out here with John on some nice crappies, some 11, 12 inches, and we got some nice fish. So we decided to come back out and chase these nice crappies again, and that is what we're doing. So we're starting off, I got a little tungsten on. These fish were pretty skittish uh, to the minnow head for me last night with a bigger Jager spoon. So I switched it up, I got a smaller presentation, and that's what I'm gonna be running. So hopefully we can get on the fish. It's uh, probably about an hour before sunset here, so we're pretty early, we should hit the bite good. And let's see what we can do. Oh God, we got John drilling. Jeez, that's crooked. Definitely not crooked. All right, so the first spot we were just set up in uh, was pretty much all northern oh, swimming around. John? There they are. There was a decent amount of northern swimming around there and no crappies. So we're in the snow bear now. We're kind of jumping around with the live scope and we're trying to find these fish. As you can see, there's a nice school around here. So there's some crappies around this spot. We're about to drill the rest of the holes and get fishing. Chill, buddy. It's not your girlfriend. Spot yeah. numero dos. It's the only Spanish I know. Yes. Cool. Other than, yeah, baby, yeah.
Yeah. Oh yeah. Come on. There we go, boys. That First one of the night. Ooh. Nice crappie. There we go. Nice crappie, John. First one of the night. We've been chasing these fish around, and it's been so hard. Finally, a school is right up near us. I'm using that tantrum with some spikes. Clocked her. Yep. Hey, my guy John's on now. Let's go. Okay, Luke. Gonna keep him entertained. Nothing around me yet. Come on. That one's right under John. Oh, this one. This one's probably oh, just that one to come up straight. That's a nice one. Oh, yeah. I gotta get back down as well. Yeah, they look right underneath you. Yeah. Right. Here we go. I got one. Wait, oh, that was you? What the frick? Oh. I thought that was yeah, me. I, yeah, I was confused, dude. Yeah, I thought I, that I was thought, me. I thought, I thought I was you. Dang. Oh my, nice. Johnny. Holy cow, John just got a nice one. Nice crappie, man. Let me get a little, uh, let me see that one, John. Girthy girls, baby. Okay, I just switched it up. Left-handed reeling with a minnow head now. Dang, that thing's right on you. Oh my god, dude! <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> Tonka, baby! <laughs> yup. Wrapped up in the Vex and all. Okay, that is embarrassing. I know there are bigger fish in this lake, so I don't think there's going to be too many of these. But, uh... Okay, well, if there's too many of these, I'm not making this video. So you guys can count on some bigger fish than this sometime here. First fish, though, we had to break the ice. And, uh... <laughs> get it? Break the ice? No? Okay. My bad. This one's definitely a little bigger than the last one. Oh yeah. Oh, that's better. Well, we we'll take them like that, dude. We will. Jeez. That's oh way better crappie. It's probably ten. Yeah, that's a. I mean, if we were eating. I mean, fish, yeah, that's an eater. If we were eating for sure. All right, this is the second fish so far. No, probably doesn't look huge on the camera. It never does it justice, but it's about a ten incher. That's a perfect eater if we were keeping fish, but. We're not going to do that yet, so I'm going to get this guy back in the water, and we're going to keep fishing, but that's a lot better. Also, if you're wondering why John's sitting so weirdly close to me, it was because of his long rod, and I know that even sounds worse, so just scratch that. I shall get filming, bud. Okay, this fish has to be... Oh, done. oh film this. This is done. Hold film on. this. No, hold on. I am clapping. Oh. <laughs> All right, well, we're getting hungry here, so I threw a little pizza in that John got, and look what John did, you guys. So you remember the one video when me and Adam went up to Lake of the Woods when Adam called him out for getting the broke boy pizza? He took offense to that. And he bought a super bougie chicken bacon ranch or something like that. Now that's a good pizza, John. Yes, sir. That ain't no jack, son. Pizza corner, baby. And then, of course, this might be featured in every camping video. We got the old aroma rice cooker here with a cup and a half of rice in there because you know how we do it. We ricing. Yeah. All right, sorry. That was weird. I'll never say that again. Ha, I will. Also, I didn't show you guys the live scope before, but there's a ton of fish down here. So if you've never used one of these before, that's a fish. All those big blobs are fish. And then that smaller stuff, some are fish, but the rest of it is just nothing. So there's a ton of fish down there. 
some of the marks are definitely bigger fish. We just need to get these things to bite and weed through the smaller ones. But hey, I caught like a six incher and the next one was 10 or 10 and a half. So we're not doing too bad so far, but we're gonna eat and we're gonna keep catching fish. Oh yeah, he's on there. Oh, sorry, I was getting some pizza. So you're telling me the old dead stick strategies of the strat? I love this lake. Brother. I'm cracked. I, oh! <laughs> oh! Good! I love fishing. I love this lake. I'm having so much fun. I'm a little bit ticked off right now. I suck. It's okay. Sodak is fire. If you guys want some BW Films merch, just go to my video, click on the link in the description, get yourself some fire BW Films merch. I got a bunch of stuff on there. That's all. Thanks, guys. That was for your video for time. Feel free to just leave it in. Ooh, that's a crappie. 100%. Ooh. Oh, biggest crappie of the night? Hey! SD? Hey! I did it. I'm actually psyched about this, dude. I'm proud of you. You were getting really sick. John was crying. You finally caught a fish. Good job, John. Oh, I'll drink to that! Oh. Yeah, baby! Yeah! Wait, cheers, bro. Hmm. Ha, psych! Hey! Now I'm gonna flex it on my Instagram and act like I've caught so many fish. Okay, oh, can oh, I wait? Can I uncheers from you? All right. Well, we have been fishing for like the last two hours since we caught the last fish, and we have not caught anything. There's a ton of fish down there. We're marking fish everywhere, but they are just absolutely shut off right now. They're not hungry. They're not being active. They're not biting us. They're not looking at us really even. They're not doing anything. They're literally just sitting there. So it's probably going to be a morning bite, and uh, hopefully we're going to get up early in the morning and see if we can catch some of these fish. But I have my line alarm down there with just a live minnow on there. I'm going to see if I can catch anything overnight or uh, still here tonight before we go to bed. And if I do, I will let you guys know. Otherwise, we will see you guys in the morning when we wake up, and hopefully we can catch some more of these crappies. See you in the morning. See ya! See ya! Good morning, everybody. Me and John just woke up and had to redrill the holes out, as you saw, because it is super freaking cold still. It is like, I don't know, negative 10 or negative 12 right now, and was like negative 15 overnight, and it's freaking freezing outside. So, we just got the holes re-drilled. Nothing this morning. We had the line alarms down and early this morning there was literally like nothing. So it is about 8.30 right now and there's like nothing down here. These fish are not biting and I don't think we're going to catch anything throughout the day. So unfortunately we're just going to have the line alarms down and maybe catch something. But we're going to get these lines down and we will see you guys when the fish start biting or when we do something dumb. Do something dumb? That's the gritty boy. Oh, look at those little nibbles. Heck yeah, brother. Little sunfish. You're getting bigger, though. I'm getting wrapped up as well. He did the loop-de-loop. -loop. John's not wrong. This is bigger than the last one, but still not what we're looking for. Dude, that thing ripped in. Like, crappie? I don't know. Yeah, it is. Decent crappie. Oh. Nice. Heck yeah, dude. Not bad at all. You could tell a difference between. Yeah, his... when they come in yeah. on the vex. Yeah. All right. Well, first crappie of the day. That thing came in a lot different. That ripped out of nowhere straight up to me and just hammered me. So, this guy was hungry. Little, I don't know, nine inch or nothing crazy, but. First crappie of the day, so I'm not complaining about that for sure. They could be a lot worse. Alright, well fishing is kind of slow as you guys can see, so John was nice enough to let me use his underwater camera. John bought the Markham Pursuit, 
underwater fish camera and we've been messing around with this thing on this trip here in South Dakota and it's been pretty cool so we're gonna drop down there we're gonna see what the heck's down there chasing us around uh, check the fish out I don't know if I'll get any catches on camera but we'll go check the fish out see what the bottom looks like and give you guys a view of what it looks like under the ice so see you guys down at the bottom Oh, little perch. Hey, guys. This line alarm is going off right now. Like, literally, but like, it's getting bit a lot. Ooh, that feels a little nicer. We got another fish, John. Ooh, a crappie, another nice crappie. Oh, nice. That's what we like to see. That's a little better than the perch. But we'll let this guy go. And I'm gonna throw that minnow back down there. That was the second fish on this minnow. He's a trooper. All right, I think I got it to where the jig's like right in front of the camera. Oh yeah, look at that. Jeez, buddy. Messing up my camera. Oh my gosh, these things are so aggressive. All right, watch this, here we go. I'm gonna come back up, ready? Here it is. Ha <laughs> ha! That was pretty sweet. That is up close and personal. These things aren't too big. I've seen a couple bigger ones on the camera down there, but uh, for the most part, this is pretty average size of what I've been catching. Just little guys, little perch down there. There we go, last fish. Surprise, surprise, another little perch. All right, well, that was the last fish that we are gonna catch for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. It was uh, pretty tough getting on the fish out here. Once this colder weather moved in, it was, I don't know, it made everything very tough for us. So as you saw, I mean, we tried smallie fishing for hours. We went in the snow bear for hours. We came here last night, fished all last night, and into this morning just to get you guys a video. So it has been really tough out here, especially getting uh, the nicer fish to bite. But that is going to wrap this video up. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you guys click that like button and subscribe to the channel down below this video if you have not done that yet. And we will see you guys on the next one. See ya!